Hey there everyone, happy holidays to everybody out there. Hopefully you guys are having a great holiday season. Welcome to the channel. I'm recording this on Christmas Eve, funny enough, I'm actually supposed to be relaxing, but here I am working for all of you out there. But anyway, I got myself some Coquito to celebrate the holiday season out here, get ready for Christmas. But I wanted to do a quick unboxing video for all of you for something that I got in the mail. This was sent to me by Solange and Sam, so two close friends of mine. Big thank you so much for sending this over to me for Christmas. And I was like, you know what? Might as well make an unboxing video for this, get content out of it, right? So this is the Razer Anzu glasses. Uh, these things are Bluetooth. They actually have uh, blue light protection on it and we're gonna unbox it and check it out. It should be fun. So here are the Razer Anzu. They're again, they're Bluetooth enabled. They have a polarized sunglasses lens on them, protect from blue light and all other types of stuff. But they also have speakers on them. They also could connect to any sort of Bluetooth device, which is pretty cool. Now, as I'm unboxing this, I'm actually trying to figure out where the plastic is to like really open up the box here. As I'm doing all this stuff, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. Have you guys had a chance to mess around with these? Have you actually given these as a gift to someone? Talk to me about it in the comment section down below. And of course, don't forget to obviously leave a like on this video if you can too. Let me know some of the different things you guys wanna actually see me unbox whenever I can, because there's a lot of cool tech out there and I would love to take a look at all of it. But anyway, here's the box. The box looks good overall, looks pretty darn good. But besides that, we want to open up this bad boy. So how do we actually open this without wrecking up this gorgeous packaging? Uh, I think this is a sleeve. I think it is. I can't tell. Okay, no, here we go. It's actually two little boxes in there. So it says Razor on it. I'm actually going to put this over here so it can stay on brand. We got two boxes that just say Razor on them. Let's open up the smaller one here, which I'm guessing is going to be a bunch of... Uh... Actually, no, it opens up this way. Ah, okay, so hold on, there's a actual thing, a QR code to scan, which is, I guess, you know, using, uh, what is it? Scan the QR code, to have a guide. Okay, so it's just a guide, but anyway, move that to the side. What's in here? Okay, these are the, the lenses. So that's interesting. These are the actual lenses themselves. You could probably see the reflection of the camera I'm using now, but those are the lenses to the glasses. So I'm guessing in here, has to be the actual glasses themselves. So let's open up this bad boy. See if you just do it slowly. That actually like wrecking anything inside because I wanna make sure that I'm careful with these. And they come in this nice case. Ooh, this is a nice, this is a nice case. It's a real nice case. It's leather, it feels real good. And there goes our glasses. And there's, there's other stuff in here, which I'll get to in a second, but here are the glasses. You can see. It's got like a little bit of a blue tint to them as far as like a reflection, which is nice. And then if we take off the plastic here, oh, wait a second, I just saw that. They, these just went on, hold on, oh, hold on. I think they went on. I actually have to find a way to sync these up to my device, which I'll probably have to charge them at some point. But again, just to look at them for now and I can hear something in them. I'm guessing, you know, that's like the little speaker. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can hear that as well, but it's just because I'm opening them up they actually went on. That's that's pretty interesting, but let me close that there. It actually has the little blue light that keeps going on and off. I'm guessing when you open them up is when they turn on. So that's interesting. Um, the other thing in here too, I wanna actually take a look at without banging up the glasses. Oh, okay, there's another little pouch. Hold on, let me put this on the side. There's another little pouch. Okay, here, I'm gonna put these in here just so I don't put them on the ground. There's another pouch I feel that actually has a USB input or, or an actual charging input. Okay, this is this is USB. This actually is USB right here. Okay, that's that's interesting. And this actually goes on to the glasses themselves. So obviously when I read the guide, it'll tell me more. Is there anything else in here that I'm feeling around? Okay, no, inside the case, it's just enough to hold the glasses. So you actually put the glasses in there now, just for the sake of just putting them in there. So they go, they fit like pretty snug. And I can see here if I'm putting them in right, here we go. Yeah, yeah there we go. They fit really snug into there. That's not bad. Not bad at all, but obviously, now hold on, there's another, this is what I'm looking for here. You see this? This is what we need. This is a guide, okay, so we could charge them. We charge them actually putting them onto the sides there. Uh, was it connected to our device, obviously? And we can install different, uh, what is it, apps onto our mobile device that allows us to connect to it. So that's what I'm definitely gonna do with my own, uh, what is it, my own phone 
And there's a couple little things in here that I see. Of course, we got a little microfiber wipe, which is neat because I have these with some other pairs of glasses that I've had in the past, but this is pretty cool because you want to be able to clean out any sort of like, you know, dust or like, uh, what is it? Uh, smudges or anything like that just so that way the glasses themselves are clean uh when you actually uh put them on and then we also have some other paperwork stuff in here which i'm going to look at just briefly see if there's nothing like too crazy uh seen here intelligently okay th this isn't too bad this is just like a special message okay uh well you're about with the razor answer you're about to enjoy a smarter kind of eyewear that protects it, your sight and immerses your ears with the combined two essential lifestyle items into one into it's time to streamline and enhance your experience for commute work and play okay cool definitely gonna see how it is when it comes to mobile devices or bluetooth but then this is obviously the guide uh nothing too crazy it seems like that's in here that's like that. Okay, yeah, it just talks about what's inside, you know, how to pair up the things, which I'm going to look at now uh, to actually see how to get these things working. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to charge them, granted, even though these still turned on as soon as we open them up. But still, these are pretty cool. This is a very, very cool gift. Did not expect this to come in over my way, and I'm glad that it did, but I'm going to check them out. I'm going to wear them, and I'll give you guys my impressions in just a bit right about now. So hey, I'm recording this now the day after Christmas Day. I decided to take all of Christmas Day just to myself, just to relax, chill, enjoy the holiday. And of course, use these throughout the day just so I can get an idea of how they feel to wear, how they look, how they sound overall. I actually have these, actually, believe it or not, connected to my tablet here. So I'm like listening to something related to Lord of the Rings. But just to give you an idea of how these things are, these are pretty good. They feel good to wear. The sound is actually coming from the side here. It's kind of like a bone conductor headphone where it actually goes to the side or like almost on like your bone part of your mouth, but they're a little bit higher to the back part of my head where I could still hear them pretty good, especially if I raise the volume, but I could still hear everything around me. As far as how they look, it'll be different for everybody because granted, uh, what is it? Depending on the style and the shape of your head, it might not work with you as far as like the, the way that the frames are designed. But again, everybody would be a little different. For me here, I don't mind them. I think they look pretty good for what they are. And again, they feel good to wear. I could wear these for a long time. I've worn these for maybe about an hour or two, give or take. These have about five hours or so of power in order to run continuously. And you actually turn them off by closing them. I can hear it even now. You guys can't really hear it, but it actually tells me that the, the glasses are off and the actual speakers are off. So you could turn them back on by opening them up. And I don't know if you can see that has the blue light that goes off where they reconnect to my tablet or any other Bluetooth device. So overall, I think that the Razer Alonzo is pretty darn good. I think that it's a neat little gadget. If you want to get this for someone as a gift, again, here's the box just to show you guys here that they come in. It's a pretty neat box, pretty neat. Uh, what is it? Case that comes with them. I actually dig the case. It's something you could put in like an extra bag or something if you're traveling around or whatnot. Are these good for a lot of travel? Maybe not, give or take, depending on what you actually do. I use these at home now. So if I'm like working with a bunch of stuff and I just want to wear these, protect my eyes from the blue light screens, as well as also to listen to something as well. You can even connect this to your iPod and listen to music or whatnot. So they're pretty good gadget overall. So anyway, big shout outs to Solange and to Sam for getting me these for Christmas. I really appreciate them. They look, again, and they, they work nice. So let me know some of your thoughts in the comment section down below what you guys think about these glasses what you guys think about the razor on zoo if you like these types of gadgets or whatnot put in the comments down below of course as always make sure that you guys like this video subscribe to the channel as well for more videos like this unboxings game video reviews and all other types of stuff that being said i will talk to all of you again very soon this channel is sponsored by flynn's arcade and more located in margate florida Flynn's is one of the premier spots for gaming fans in South Florida. They have a variety of arcade games on cabinet for you to play throughout the week, including all of your beloved classics. You could also play a ton of new and current console games too, on PlayStation, Xbox, and Nintendo consoles. Grab a snack or drink and enjoy the best gaming experience you'll find. Visit during one of their many big events to connect with the gaming community in South Florida. Want to test your skills in competitive fighting games? Join any of the weekly tournaments that happen at Flynn's for a chance for some cool prizes. And if you're into tabletop gaming or model kit building, there's a bunch of events there for you too. Swing by Flynn's Arcade and more, located in Margate Boulevard in Margate, Florida. You won't find a better spot than Flynn's. Thanks a bunch for watching the video. I really appreciate it a ton. I'll have more videos for you to enjoy here on the side that I know you'll love. 
make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon too. Don't forget to visit my Patreon linked below for early access to new videos every week, and join the Discord server too. It's linked in the description box below. You'll definitely love being a part of it. Thanks again, peace out, and stay epic everybody.